all right we are okay what the, okay <laughs> all right we are back i'm your host mid and we are playing grim dawn if it doesn't crash on us again <laughs> so the last hour of clearing our, our way towards the end boss basically got undone and now i gotta fight my way through all that stuff again just to get to it because i don't have any uh it was way far between waypoints i don't even know if there's another waypoint before the end boss so let's go all right all the way back here so we had cleared out all of this area this area and then we went into the flesh works cleared out the top level we were, I think, close to clearing out the second level, and then the game crashed. So now all the mobs have respawned, and I have to fight my way back through. So I'm going to see what is going to be the shortest, most direct route. And right, I think I'm going to go down here, go through this building. This connects, even though it doesn't look like it. Make your way through, down into there. Over here. Yeah. I gotta take it slow though because there are a bunch of heroes between here and the uh, flesh works. So if I aggro them, it's. Yeah, they're gonna keep chasing me. I'm probably just gonna die before I can get very far. And then I gotta work my way all the way back through all that. So it's better off just to kill everything as I go. There's gonna be stuff spawning here. Yep, there it is. Just want to get in here. Yes. Come up here, get line of sight, and stand in my thermite mines. I would appreciate that. Oh, don't run away in fear. Oh, there's a hero. Azar the Rat Wraithful. Yeah, that was one of the most bizarre heroes. It's a little wisp, so it's hard to see. I was like, why is there just a, a hero star floating there? I don't see anything. I had to look close, and I was like, oh, there's a wisp. That is the hero. Got it. All right, so I'm going to go down here. Gonna be guys spawning here. Or not. Come on, die, Sentinel. Die, Sentinel. Alright, work my way through here. Oh! Hero. Okay. Come on in. Come on out. No, get rid of that. Ah. Ah, crud. Crud. Run, run away. I, I got my buttons all mixed up. 
somehow I switched down to where my buffs were and it got me all confused. I'm like, okay, why am I not throwing stuff and I'm turning my buffs off and ugh, a mess. <laughs> See what's left of my wares. See you around. All right, let's get up there. here as fast as we can get back to the fight all right die already come on jeez grab my corpse get my XP back or some of my XP back oh don't no. ah crud get 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 no uh One of the more frustrating bosses, or uh, heroes. It's going to be quicker to run down here and jump through this portal than it is to zone out, go to the next one. Because for some reason it wants to keep defaulting me back into the sewers. Get out of the way of that damn thing. Oh, now he's right on top of me. Awesome. Alright, get the... Alright, run away. Because apparently he has the most insane friggin... damage-dealing crap in existence. I can't do that. It's like he's a level 61 for crying out loud. <laughs> He has weapon attacks that are just, I can't get out of the way in time. Even if I'm dodging, it's like, eh, you might be able to, but no, probably not. <laughs> uh, that is one of the more frustrating friggin' heroes to take care of. But he is in my way and I have to kill him so that I can get to where I was. Die, bastard. move along.
No, go up there. Pretty much a straight shot through here. Great hero. Die, die, die. Excellent. He died a lot quicker than the other. Grim's the only one left. All the, the other guards died. Take that. Uh-huh. Alright, so let's drop a portal here. Alright, we need to get all the way over to here. Because that's blocked. Alright, so we're just going to clean out this way, just go straight. Maybe work our way straight across and up this hallway and then over and around. Okay. Yeah, I'm not re clearing the entire map. Okay, when am I going to start healing? <laughs> I think there's a hero up ahead here as well.
Die! Come on! I was like, jeez! Am I hitting him and nothing's happening? And death spirals. Come on, go away, death spiral. And the weird whaling. All right. So I'm at 18 minutes and I'm almost back to where I left off. I'm gonna die or not I somehow survived that excellent totally thought I was dead okay let's just keep on moving almost there almost there Riff that. Okay. And I think it actually rolled me back a little bit because I had gotten over into this area and had discovered some doors so yeah i got rolled back not much but i got rolled back a bit
which means up here is going to be some really a tough pack of guys. That's a hero, I just realized. Oh, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, and I'm gonna die. That sucks when you have nothing you can- Oh, I did have a cleanse I could've used. <sighs> but I was too busy yelling that I was dying. <laughs> Okay, what do these look like? Yeah, none of these are looking very good to me. neat. Actually, yeah, I'm going to keep that. I could go with this uh, thing here. So if I go for a Vitality Aether uh, build, which I'm contemplating, that would actually be pretty damn cool. Back down here, jump through the portal, get to where I left off. What a bizarre sight, a free human here? Then perhaps we can come to an understanding. You must know 
that I no longer carry favor with the ethereal with the ethereal masters. For my actions against the master of flesh, I have been imprisoned here until my final judgment. Spare me my fate, and I shall continue to fight for the survival of humans. I promise you that. Hmm. Why are you in prison? Why should I believe anything you say? Why are you imprisoned? As I lived within this host, I learned more of your passions, your joys and sorrows. I learned what it must be, what it was to be human, and I found it fascinating. Others insisted that I insisted that I quell what you call emotions, but they offered a euphoria that I had never experienced before. This led me to continue the methods of continue to question the methods of my ethereal brethren. While I had the fortune had the fortune to possess a human of noble and uplifting spirit, it is clear that many of our kind have possessed less vi virtuous humans, and I see a corruption spreading among many who have led this campaign to conquer your physical realm. Unaccustomed to moderating human emotion uh, and sensations, the vices and flaws inherited in some of your kind have become amplified and driven my breth brethren beyond ruthless efficiency to depravity and deliberate cruelty. I feel that if I could return to the Aetherhold and convey my experiences, higher powers may intervene and cease this invasion. However, the Master of Flesh and other leaders of the invasion do not want the greater Ethereals to know what is happening here and will never let me return. Although, even if I could return, I do not know if any intervention would come in time to help you. Time and thought seem to pa pass much more slowly in the Aetherhold. Um... Why should I believe anything you say? Impending doom. Why can't you simply leave? I have been bound here by the Master of Flesh. The crystal barrier between us keeps me trapped. Open it and I shall f be free to escape the place. This place and know that your mercy will not be forgotten. You know what? I'm in the mood to see if uh, this is actually going to pay off. Let's do... Actually, is there a... Is this one of the choices I have? Let me look in the new player guide here. So this is help them escape. Oh, okay, this was actually someone different, I think. Um, you know what? I'm going to let him free. Don't make me regret this. And he disappeared just like that. Okay. Yeah, around here is going to be where I think, or here. Is it here? There's going to be a pack of baddies. That's disturbing, the weird little glowy green eyes looking at me. One's over there too. Sanctum of F Flesh Entrance, the Living Factory. Um, I believe I am already in a living factory, but okay. Locked.
Okay, he just came out of nowhere. <laughs> I'm like, I don't recall him running back there, but okay. There is an aether barrier. Oh, he is a hero. Run. Oh, run, 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 run. He's one of the bosses I need to kill. Come on, give me some healing. Give me some damn healing. Okay, he's running off again, okay. Oh, don't crash again. Are you kidding me again? What the heck? In the same spot. Are you kidding me? Well, let's see if it actually responds. I'm going to give it a minute because this is if this is where it's going to crash every single time, then I can't finish the damn game and I'm just going to go run like some stuff outside of this because, wow, that's really friggin lame if that's the case. Okay, we have to restart the game again. Yeah, I'm not sending a crash report to Grimdong because obviously this is a couple years old. If they haven't fixed it by now, they're probably never going to fix it. Lovely. Oh, I'm getting some drop frames on my uh, OBS. That's, that's wonderful. All right, let's restart it again. And I got right back in about half hour where I was. And it friggin' bombed. Okay, so... This does it again, then I am not gonna keep trying to do this. Because that's really annoying and stupid, and it's a waste of my time. Yay! not and let's see how far back it rolls me yeah not not overly happy seriously not overly happy why is a bunch of my stuff stuck out here okay that's weird Fifty percent burn. Um, forty-eight percent burn, fifty percent fire. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna use that. Hang on to that. So yeah, if uh, this happens again, then I'm going to probably either do a little bit of cru uh, crucible play or just start off the next difficulty level. 
and maybe give this a shot at some other time in the future because that's going to be really friggin' annoying if it keeps dying right there. And there's no good way of getting back there. I mean, I spent 30 minutes getting back to that point. So yeah, that was really friggin' annoying. Put it to good use. Yay, so there's that. That's that's wonderful. Let's go back to there and now I gotta go fight those that annoying level 61 wizard who's gonna kill me four times before I kill him. Cause he has the unavoidable fireballs and meteors that stun me. Alright, and spawn! There you go. See how fast we can get there. Alright, yep. Val Valaxtria. Level 64, no wonder he was a level 64 and not a 61. So, yeah, that's annoying. Well, surprisingly, I was able to actually get the Velaxtria guy down pretty freaking far without him killing me. Wow, I actually did not die fighting him. Whoa. I think it's because I remembered he was there. And I remembered how annoying he was. <laughs> Oh, 
Um, keep firing. Why are you not firing? Okay, that's really weird that there are times where my guy is actually not firing his weapons when I'm clearly telling him to fire them. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Hold the fort and uh, try not to die. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm not at the point where I'm like, I don't give a crap. I just want to get through this as fast as possible. reverse this because I'm always mixing up nullification with my mirrors because I need my nullification more than I need mirrors at times or I mean uh, I need my mirrors more than I need nullification at times That's what it sounds like. It sounds like Vader yelling no from episode three. No. Oh, level 62, ethereal human. Come on out, buddy. Okay, that's a fire that's kind of following me, which is kind of weird. What? Okay, I was like, that was bizarre. Never seen that power before. 
It is the slowest death you will ever not see, or ever see coming a mile off. And if you die from it, then that's kind of weird. Death spirals. Do not want to stand in those. close. No! Okay, Vader, I'm not gonna come save you, man, because you're, you're evil. to go empty out my pack and okay let's see if I can actually get back to where it crashed without it crashing see anything you like We're going to hang on to that because I have a feeling one of my builds is going to be a vitality bleed type of drain. All right, we're going to hang on to that axe too. Okay. Get these all 
in there. Yeah, interesting thing is I still got the items that I had gotten last time before I crashed, but okay. Let's see what happens. Okay, so it did save my progress over there. Not up here, though, I don't think. Right. Spawn! Yes, you know it's screwed up when I can actually remember where the secret spawns are. Okay, giant's blood. So that is on there. Okay, that dude's gone, all right. Okay, I think I'm going to run into the flesh shaper dude up ahead here.
Okay, let's get... Okay, so that's clear. Let's get this clear over to that crystal gate. Which is right up there. Oh, here comes bad guy. Alright, let's pop a portal here, go empty our bags. Hoping that my game doesn't crash. <laughs> Fifty-five percent fire and fifty-eight percent burn. Oh, what was that? That was oh yeah. I'm going to take a quick five minute break, get, stretch my legs, get something to drink, and oh, let's hope that my game does not crash again when I come back. Whew. Pardon me. Uh, all right, let me set my, my counter. All right, so. Um, all right, so I will see you guys in five minutes. Be back shortly. 